Welcome to another Ziva Math video. In this video, we're going to learn about finding the area of a circle. We'll use the formula area equals pi r squared to calculate the area, where a is our area. Pi will use 3 and 14 hundredths, or if you're able to use a calculator, you'll just use the pi button on your calculator. r is the radius, and if you're given a diameter and need to calculate the radius, Diameter divided by 2 equals your radius. Let's take a look at our examples. To find the area of a circle, we're going to use the formula area equals pi times radius squared. And in this example, we do have a radius. Our radius is 16 feet. So we will have area equals, for pi, we'll use 3 and 14 hundredths times our radius of 16 squared. Now one thing to note, if you're using a calculator, you'll enter pi into the calculator using the pi button on your calculator when solving. The rest of us will need to use the 3 and 14 hundredths times 16 squared. And we'll need to start our calculations with the 16 squared, so 16 times 16. And we'll start by multiplying by the 6. 6 times 6 is 36. 6 times 1 is 6, plus 3 more is 9. Then we'll multiply by the 1. 1 times 6 is 6, and 1 times 1 is 1. And we will add. So 6 plus 0 is 6, 9 plus 6 is 15, and 1 plus 1 is 2. So 16 squared is 256. And now we'll need to multiply 3 and 14 hundredths times 256. And again, we'll start by multiplying in the 1's place with the 6. 6 times 4 is 24. 6 times 1 is 6, plus 2 more is 8. 6 times 3 is 18. And next we'll multiply by the 5. 5 times 4 is 20. 5 times 1 is 5, plus 2 more is 7. And 5 times 3 is 15. Then we'll multiply by the 2. 2 times 4 is 8. 2 times 1 is 2, and 2 times 3 is 6. And remember, we place our decimal point as our very last step. So we are adding next 4 plus 0 plus 0 is 4. 8 plus 0 plus 0 is 8. 8 plus 7 is 15, plus 8 more is 23. 2 plus 1 is 3, plus 5 is 8, plus 2 more is 10. And 6 plus 1 plus 1 is 8. To place our decimal point, we're going to look in our problem. We have two places behind the decimal point in our problem. So in our product, we'll have two places behind the decimal point there as well. So we'll have an area of 803 and 84 hundredths feet squared. To find the area of a circle, we use the formula area equals pi r squared, where r is our radius. And in this example, we don't have a radius, so we're going to have to calculate our radius. Because our radius goes from the center of the circle to the outer edge of the circle. So what we've been given is the diameter. And to find the radius, we take our diameter and we divide it by 2. So we're going to take the diameter of 40 and divide it by 2 to calculate our radius. 40 divided by 2 is 20, so the radius of this circle is 20 meters. Then we can go back to our formula, area equals, for pi, we use 3 and 14 hundredths times our radius of 20 squared. One thing to note if you're using a calculator, you'll enter pi into the calculator using the pi button on your calculator when solving. The rest of us, in order to complete the calculation, will use 3 and 14 hundredths for pi. And we're going to start with our 20 squared, which is 20 times 20. While multiplying by the 0, we get 0. Then we'll need to multiply by the 2. 2 times 0 is 0, and 2 times 2 is 4. And then we add 0 plus 0 is 0, 0 plus 0 again is 0, and 4 plus 0 is 4. So 20 squared is 400. And we'll multiply the 400 times the 3 and 14 hundredths. So again, 0 times 4 times 1 times 3 is 0. We'll multiply by 0 again. 0 times 4 times 1 times 3 is 0. Then we'll need to multiply by the 4. 4 times 4 is 16. 
4 times 1 is 4, plus 1 more is 5, and 4 times 3 is 12. And then we will be adding. So 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0. 6 plus 0 is 6. 5 plus 0 is 5. 2 plus 0 is 2. And 1 plus 0 is 1. Then it will be time to place our decimal point in the correct place. In our problem, we had two places behind our decimal point. So in our answer, we'll need two places behind our decimal point, which means that our area will be 1,256 meters squared. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to Ziva Math for more videos.